Mama, k s o n at it again. What's up? You already know, man. It's Trey Pound, and I'm fucking with my dog, k s o n J. And Mama, we at it again, yeah. Hey, what's going on? It's your boy k s o n J, and I'm in the building with my boy Trey Pound. What's going on with you, Trey? What's up, man? You know, I'm fighting, bro. What's good with you? Not much to the man, you know, just getting to it. I can dig that. I can dig that for sure, s u r But you know, this is our first time, you know what I'm saying, doing a little interview, so let's start from the beginning, man. Where you from? Shit, I'm from、um, Richmond, Virginia. You feel me? 804, you know what I'm saying? Okay. 804. 804. Okay, okay, okay. okay. So,、um, how would you describe your upbringing growing up? Like, I mean, shit, like. It's pretty much like anywhere in any city, you know I mean? I'm from the West End, you feel me? I'm from o u t of Wood, you know what I'm saying? So, and then, like, my e r a different from the e r a that's out here now, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, damn. I'm a little older, you know what I'm saying? But still, though, like, back then, it was lit, you feel me? We was, we was having that way back then, or at least I was, because my people was, you know what I'm saying? Because I was, like I said, I was a j e t And then, it's ended up in the Jets, you hear me? <laughs> But I'm stuck right now. The Ward, then my people, Jackson Ward, shout out all my dog around Jackson Ward and shit. You know what I'm saying? Long live my dog, Reggie Badass, you feel me? Stop, nigga, you feel me? So, because of shit like that, I got tired of ain't even s c r e e t s and shit out there, you know what I mean? So. Alright, alright, alright. So, um.、Uh... In school, like, what kind of kid was you in school? You know, you, you know what I'm saying? Was you、uh, a good kid, bad kid, getting in a lot of trouble? Or, you know, did you finish? Nah, I mean, I job was all right in school. I graduated type shit. You know what I'm saying? I, I was an athlete and everything. But I ain't finished school in, in Richmond, though. Yeah. I ended up moving to、um, Portsmouth, that P Town. You feel me? And、um, I moved to Portsmouth, Virginia, and ended up going to school out that job. Graduated out there. I got played football and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? So I was jive. You was running back, fullback? Yeah, I played running back. You know what I'm saying? I was jive. Okay, okay, okay. So、uh, when did the music come apart and you,、uh, you start rapping and stuff? When that come about? I fuck around and、uh, got locked up type shit. Oh, shit. When was this? How long ago was this? Shit, I,、uh, I caught a case, goddamn. I caught my case in life. In like 08, nah, 09 type shit. Yeah, I caught my case in 09. And, um, did a little bit. I caught a shooting jump. Yeah, did a little bit. Um, came out. I did like three on that jump. But that was only because of my lawyer. Shout out Craig fucking Cooley, man. Best lawyer in Richmond, Virginia. You hear me? Yeah. But, um, I did like three on that jump. But you know, I was young and dumb. I was only home like. 89 days, you feel me? And I、yeah. quit five, yeah. I got on home 85 days and quit another five years. They gave me the whole pound for the jump. Oh, you know I mean? My brother Boom was like the last nigga I seen before I left the streets, man. Goddamn.、Yeah. That nigga Boom Boom from Jackson Ward. Like, that's my brother, like, only nigga from the street that got down. He walked down to jail to come see me one time. Like,、yeah. bro made sure he was fucking with me. Like,、Thanks. you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, like, I can I tell to y'all about bro all day. That's my dog right there. But. Yeah, yeah, did that. So that's eight, you know what I'm saying? Damn. Feel me? I fuck around and、um, my folks moved down here to Carolina. Yeah. And、um, they gave me this shit called an interstate compact.、Mm -hmm. So you gotta file the jump like the state, cause I was getting released from prison type shit. The state gotta be on something. Is y'all willing to accept c u b Yeah. So it took a little minute, but、um, I had lost, just lost my dad or whatever, and I had to let the folks know I'm moving down there to go be with my peoples and shit. And、yeah. They passed the jump through me, and,、um, and I'm coming down here. I j o b b i n g all right. So I've been here, you feel me? I got off probation, and I've been s c r e e t you feel me? Yeah. Fat, fat, yeah, yeah. So you say you was rapping in, in jail? Yeah,、said? I started rapping locked up, you know what I'm saying? And,、um, Niggas just used to be like, c u h h a h you need to、yeah. go home and do that shit. Boom, 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 boom. And shit, that's what I did, type shit. I came down this junk, registered my label, junk. Okay, what's your label? Three d o n s Entertainment, Day One Nation, you feel、okay. me? Like, you know what I'm saying? Day One Station <laughs> shit, like, you feel me? Like,、yeah. now niggas gonna come train this shit, you feel me? So, that shit copywritten, you know what I mean? 
and I'm an artist on my own label. So since 2017, 18, when I dropped my first single, I've been getting paid for music. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. But it all come with time, though. You know what I mean? Shit got better with time, though. You know what I mean? Fucking with good promoters out here in this Carolina in the ENC, yeah. niggas like Gunner and uh-huh. you know what I'm saying Cognac Gunner put a nigga on the show and shit. Niggas fuck around, turn me up. My, niggas like Vito and them got down yeah, yeah. inviting niggas out to their parties and shit in the burn and little shit like that, turning me up. Niggas out here fucking with me, you feel me? Yeah. DJ P Money spent my shit on the radio and little shit like that. You know what I mean, so yeah. the ENC fuck with a nigga tough. And, I mean, so I just like I'm gonna keep going. I guess they fucking with how I'm coming. Yeah. So did you record any of them songs that you made in jail? You, you, you got out? Hell nah. Yeah, nah. <laughs> I got hey, I ain't even gonna hold you, bro. I got a stack of vanilla envelopes. Yeah. Rap. F- raps from jail that I ain't never rap. Fact. <laughs> probably ain't gonna never rap. I probably never rap them jokes. Right, like right. if I was to go through and rap them jokes, like I probably have to have you cause I know you made beats make, and shit. Make a beat for Yeah, it. like you would have to be there for me every session and I'll just get you to make a beat to all them jokes. I got some hard shit in there. Okay. You know what I'm saying? We can do that. Okay. And um uh, So um you got the mixtapes out? Yeah, I just dropped um my project Motion Man. You know what I'm saying? Um that joke, like I'm fucking with that joke the dumb way. Motion yeah. man, that's my shit. Like, and I realized dedicate that joke to my dog Jug. You feel me? Free him. You know what I'm saying? They got him on the Joes doing time up the road. But you know what I'm saying? Shout gonna be out this bitch no time. You feel me? They ain't even talk about that. But um I got Motion Man out. Like I said earlier, I'm from the West End. I got West End Baby out and I got the West End Baby Deluxe Joe. You know what I mean? I'm good, man. I got I got down. And I got a little, little EP joint called Four Way with okay. like four songs on there. I got um some singles and shit out. I uh did a project with my dog Ryan Marshall. You uh-huh. know what I'm saying? He from out here, he from um Richlands and shit. Bro got down, hit me up one day. Me, me and Ryan did a tape together without me even jive, even knowing who bro was type shit. Like yeah. my white boy dumb hard, like he from Vieto. Okay. Me and bro met down here. He from Lynchbury, you feel me? Yeah. And me and bro met down here type shit. And whole time bro country, out country, but we got down That's in the country. Yeah. <laughs> That's what's up. That's we fuck what's around up. and dropped a couple songs and put together a tape, mixed breed, that joint out. I got a little catalog. I can't Man. I can't, you know what I mean? Like, I got some shit in the making. So um what you would say like is your like your um biggest song, your most known song that people gravitate to the most? Um, Cadillac. Cadillac. Yeah, Cadillac is real talk, probably like. The impact of that joint hit me different because of how it went down. What's the story oh, behind this song? Yeah, like. What's the story behind this one? <laughs> but it is though, like, also. I just, it's crazy. I can't go into detail on that joint, but it's awesome. The song yeah. and the video happened the same day. Like, okay, I woke up in Carolina. Yeah. yeah. I woke up in North Carolina, left, went to go meet with my brother, Boom and them. Like, I was just my old, fuck with them. Like, I say that my dog hit me then when I was in jail. A lot of fucking with him on the street. You feel me? So, yeah. I got down, went and fucked with Bro now. And was like, Taking care of business, boom boom. I went to um Saks Fifth and shit. Yeah. Caught me some shit, boom boom. Go to the studio. Get the, my man, um, they said and see though, they my producers and yeah. shit that I was fucking with and shit. They said and see though, they and I'm like, man, send me some beats and shit. Shout out my dogs too. I'm like, send me some beats and shit. Bro, shoot the jump to me. I'm like, plug me in, go to the studio, call the nigga 96 Digital, shout out nine, got down. Bro was like whole time niggas been saying you was ready to come up this jump. Woo yeah. woo. I was ready for you. I'm like, he like send me the song. I'm like, I'm rapping that bitch. Yeah. He like, what you mean? I'm like, you know I'm, I I don't be writing. I be punching in and shit. Okay. I be freestyling every jump. So he like send me the song. I'm like, I'm rapping that bitch right now. So just pull up and record what we doing right now. <laughs> oh God, like, I'm just like pull up and record what we doing right now. Yeah. So me and my bro and I'm saying it's me and the guys in this bitch and we got there just doing us. And by the time he get there, I'm on the part of doing my um ad libs and I'm ending the song for real. So. The whole part of the scenes when we in the studio and this shit like that and yeah. I'm rapping to the John and it's like 
I just I don't even know the words yet. Yeah. Like, I'm just I just rap this bitch. You know what I mean? So I'm I'm hearing it for the first time too. That I mean, you feel <laughs> Then we go outside. Then we go outside, but he gets some scenes outside and then some janks outside. People wouldn't really know they had we just stop chatting and shit. He got there all outside, downtown Richmond, you feel me? Yeah. So I'm like, damn, this joke, I ain't you feel me. And then like I say, I ain't I ain't nobody special, but you feel me? It made me feel good to be able to come back to, you know what I'm saying? My shit ain't got down after being gone for a little minute. And then the folks that's fucking with me know they like, damn, well, yeah, bro, shot this here, you feel me? Then my folks just, I'm fucking with in Carolina, they like, well, yeah, I know bro stamp because he went back and did that. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? He ain't out here lying to us, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, um, that's what's up, man. I know the first video I seen from you was when you was in the, um, the store, using the store, so you made a shot of video in the store. That's like the first video I've seen. From the you. ultimate op jump. I, I know, I think Blanco shot it. Yeah, my very first video, like, also, that shout out Blanco. Video. Like, that was my very first video. That junk got like 20,000 or some shit like yeah. that. That junk got the most screams and the most views type shit. Yeah. But that was because, like, the, the impact of that hit hard as a bitch when it happened. Yeah. And then it be, and it's old, so it just had time to grow. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So niggas still fuck with that joint. Like, I was, I wasn't even rapping this Trey Pound on that joint. Like, what you I was back then, I was going by City Boy Trey type oh, shit. Oh, man. Because it's a non nigga out here. They call bro. Said it too, you feel oh, okay. me? Yeah, 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 yeah. So it was crazy, like, I think I and I, I've been playing, but at first I was also, cause like I said, I was locked up. Everybody was telling me, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. But the music shit, and the music shit, rapper shit. So I'm reading legal books, and I'm trying to figure out how can I be marketable to them folks. And yeah. in my head, I'm like, I can't got down. Go out there telling them folks my name, Trey Pam, man. Them folks yeah. gonna be like, dude, ass. You feel what I'm saying? Who go, how we gonna book this nigga, man? This nigga, you know what I mean? But then it's like, shit, that was old. Cause look at now, you know what I mean? You got niggas named Big Thunder and shit. Shout out them niggas, they sweet and shit. But yeah. you feel me, like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So I'm just saying, I don't know. I just tried to, you feel me? But I'm like, yeah, fuck it, boom. I stopped using that junk though. Cause I'm like, that yeah. shit whack. Fact. That shit long as a bitch. I yeah. ain't even trying to push the junk. And that shit hard, being independent. So I'm pushing that junk like, it was weird, so I'm like, man, let me do it like this. So the Trey Pound name has been good for you? That been my name, so. Yeah. Yeah, I'm saying, as an artist, it ain't gave me no problems, though, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Like, it ain't, it ain't stopped me from shit. I still yeah. done get books, like, yeah. Yeah. still on flyers and all that good shit. So, man, yeah. still coming from me. Yeah. Yeah. But look, a lot of shit going on in the industry right now. Yeah. I know you see this shit with Young Thug, Gunner, his YSL shit, his Rico shit. So, what, how you feel about this shit? You feel like this rap shit is. It's dangerous for a rapper right now. First off, though, Freedom Boys, but yeah, cause that shit fire. As an artist, I feel like that shit crazy. Cause I mean, a nigga has, is an artist. Nigga could say anything. Yeah, like I can go and be an actor, nigga, yeah. and and wake up, bro. The nigga. Michael B. Jordan could yeah. say he had to go to therapy and everything after playing one of his roles. When a cub woke up one day and thought he really was a, a shooter nigga or something. Like with them roles he be playing and being a blue nigga, you know what I mean? Anything, yeah. you feel what I'm saying? They ain't gonna Rico Cud, eh? What if one of his peoples or something went and did some crazy shit? They ain't gonna Rico do that eh? Cause they know that's his job. Just like a rapper, bro. This shit nigga get paid. So you, nigga can say what they want to say. Nigga can be like a nigga capping it, whatever the fuck. Mm -hmm. You feel me? But. At the end of the day, this shit ain't nothing but entertainment. You know yeah. what I'm saying? It's the it's the entertainment industry. You feel what I'm saying? So so for a motherfucker to be like, oh, cause you said this, you did this. Yeah. All right, now show me then. Yeah. So look, so did this make you switch your shit up now? You, Facts. Do you watch what you say in your song? Absolutely, cause I'm more cautious, more aware. Yeah. I say crazy shit too now. You know what I mean? Yeah. Don't get me wrong, but it's like. I be saying shit that's relevant to like my situation, the shit that's going on with me or shit that I done been through type shit, you know what I mean? Yeah. So, but I, I can't speak on that junk, but if it ever came to me like that, it's going to be what it's going to be. Yeah. I'm a, hey bro, y'all ain't finna say goddamn this and that, this and that. Yeah. Okay, okay. I feel you on that, I feel you on that. So, uh, Trey Pine, what can people be expecting from you coming up? Shit, I got a couple projects coming, man. I just been going through some shit. I uh, had to fall back from a little bit, you know what I mean? 
Mm-hmm. Get my shit together, goddamn deal with some personal shit, family shit, know what I'm saying? Yeah. Um, but I'm trying to put it in my music though, trying to get my shit straight, cause I mean, I'm on the hear me too, you feel me? Yeah. I don't even be doing shit like this. This is my first little interview, you know what I mean? Fact. So I don't even, I be on some other uh, shit. Yeah. All them 50 niggas this right there, bro. Yeah. It's cause I ain't, I won't try, I don't know what it's gonna happen to me. Hey y'all. <laughs> So look, people want to get in contact with Trey Fine, how can I get in contact with you? Shit, you can hit me up on the ground, man. Um at Real Trey Pound. Goddamn, you can um shit, I still got a Facebook. My Facebook, Benjamin Spendington, nigga. No okay. man. <laughs> shit, you know how I'm coming. <laughs> So shit, uh, real Trey Pound on the ground, Benjamin Spendington on the book, you feel me? On Apple, Trey Pound, on YouTube, Trey Pound, on Google, Trey Pound, on goddamn Amazon, Trey Pound, you know what I'm saying? On your little brother phone, Trey Pound, on your little sister phone, Trey Pound, on your mama phone, your daddy phone, your granny phone, Trey Pound. You know what I mean? <laughs> so it's gonna be, it ain't too hard to find type fair, shit. Fair, like. fair, fair. So, um, but well, yeah, Trey, probably gonna wrap that up, man. I appreciate you coming out here, fucking with you, boy. Hell yeah, you know bro. Saying? I fuck with you, bro. You know what I'm saying? You got a lot of shit going, bro. I got down. Appreciate you for even got down. Picking, picking up on my my little wave, bro. I'm saying you wanted to come see what I was about to talk to me. You feel me? Yeah. So I'm fucking with you because you fucking with me, bro. You know what I mean? Right, man. It's your boy K Sign J. We at it again.